What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Ark Scorched Earth oh, Scorched Earth Aberration Ascended. Sorry about that. Last we left off, we like um moved to a new base and we tamed a parasair as well as a bunch of crabs. And let me just show you around real quick. So yeah, this is the base I came up with. So this is the main base. Looks pretty big. We got everything we could need here. We got the smithy, the refining forge, we got a dino storage box. We've also got two preserving bins because I needed a second one because the other one was full. Nothing in here at the moment. I also tamed up this Listro that was just wandering around the pen area as well as this otter here, Jay Oddington. It was a max level otter that was just in that river like right in front of us. So I tamed him. I also got Luna. I got Pugsley a girlfriend and I bred them up and now we have Tiffany. This is Tiffany, the uh, the daughter of Luna. And then we got Cosmo, who's still just chilling over here. Healing up from the health that, that we've given him. So, let me show you what I... I got some more storage boxes and whatever. And it's very dark in here. Can I turn on this light real quick? There we go. It's always so dark in this base. Alright, so if we open up here, I built myself a pen. We've walled this off. Like, we've got a bunch of sheep just roaming around here. we got the female here. We've got the three males here. And then we've got the Megalosaurus, which I've named Sunrise. As well as the Raptor, which I named Sunset. Toro's still here. we got our main crab, which I named Mr. Crabs. And then we got the other crabs. We've got Crab, Guard Crab West Side. And then on the other side, we've got Guard Crab East Side. So we got Rampage over here, we got the Moss Chops, the Horse, we got Big Ben the Parasair, which I named. We got Tank the Ankylo. We got the Bear, which I named Estelle, named after Estelle Harris, the actress who played a bear in Brother Bear. You know the one that's like, I remember the day I lost my husband, Edgar. Honey, quit telling everyone I'm dead! <laughs> you know that Brother Bear reference? Yeah, there's that. And then we got Guard Crab East Side, which guards the East Side. And then if we go in here, I also built some troughs. If we go in here, I made a little balcony here. Kind of like what we did on the center series. And where I could see everything from here. Down there is a greenhouse. I put a set of stairs down here. It's fine if it's kind of walled off. As long as I can get up and down, that's fine. I also tamed up a couple of dung beetles. So we have a fresh garden. We're making narco berries and whatever crops we've got in here. I've tilled the soil with the shovel, so we shouldn't have to worry about that. We shouldn't have to worry about the garden or anything like that. Oh, and I also got this plant species X. It's only giving me the option to demolish it. I do not know how this works. I can't access this inventory, it just wants me to demolish it. So, if you guys could let me know what to do with this, let me know in the comments down below, then I'd be happy to, I'd be happy to find out. Alright, yeah, because we need its fruit to tame ourselves the Yi Ling. So, we're gonna have to, we're gonna tame a Yi Ling at some point. So, not this episode, next episode, or maybe not next episode either. But today in this episode, I'd like to tame at least one Spino. I'd like to get a Spino going. There's got to be a high level Spino somewhere around here. And since they're mostly in the rivers, we're gonna take the Sarko here, which I named Termagator. Get it? Instead of Terminator. All right, so we're gonna take the Croc, simply because he can traverse the water a lot quicker. Hold on, you are a he, right? Oh no, you're a she. Alright. She can traverse the water quicker. I mean, we do have the crab as well, but you're not as fast. I mean, you can jump. But we'll mostly be spending our time in the water. So we don't have to worry about that, really. Alright, let's go down. We got two spinos already. Look at that. Let's see what level these guys are. We got a 5 and an 85. We can definitely do better than that. There's, there's two more. There's a 30 and a 25. Yeah, we can definitely do better than that. There's a Gigantoraptor. What level are you? That's a 20. 
Yeah, I'd like to tame a Gigantoraptor at some point. Yeah, you attack very slow, that's the only problem. Yeah, there are just Spinos everywhere on this, on, in this river. Yeah, we just got Spinos everywhere. Okay, Scorpion, I need you to not be there. Oh, we're just gonna kill everything in the area. Oh, what level is this Raptor? 70? Alright. That's a 75 Stego. Alright, what up, Carno? Goodbye. We're saving that baby, alright. You're a 30. Let's kill you real quick. Alright, I do see another Spino. Yeah, luckily these guys are everywhere on this map. So what level are you? You're a 35, alright. We can definitely do a little better than that. A game, game. Game. Thank you. That's Parasair. There's a couple more Spinos right there. That's a 25. There's a max level creature somewhere around here. I wonder if one's one of these creatures. 35. Yeah, 25 Spino. We're gonna have to kill you. No hard feelings, just business. Nothing personal. We're getting so many sales from global you. You're a 5. Of course you are. Yeah, we can definitely do way better than this. Yeah, we are just a lot faster in the water. That's what makes us so perfect. I see another Spino over there. What level are you? 25? All right. Looks like I'm getting rid of you. I'm just going to clear the area of the, all the Spinos, all the garbage level Spinos, see if we can get a better one. What level is this Ravager? If you could be a high level female, you're a 15. I was going to say, if you could be a high-level female, then I would definitely tame you. Because I need to get a girlfriend for Rampage so we can get an imprinted version. Or an imprinted pack of them. Hey, there's old base. Nice. Alright, I have seen Spinos above here. So maybe we might find a Spino up here. Or something. We're going to have to climb up here to get there. There's a 90 Gigantoraptor here. I did come across a 125, so if I go up after a Gigantoraptor, I might go after the 125. All right, we'll circle around here for a little bit, and then we'll see if we can find another Spino here. All right, I'm not seeing any Spinos. There's one right here. That's a five, of course it is. We can do better than that. We can certainly do better than that. I see a sail. There's a Spino over there. Let's see what level this guy is. 25. Eh, we can kill you. Just killing all the garbage level Spinos, hoping that a high level will spawn. There's the new base. There's our current base, and I see a Spino right in front of us. If the game could stop freezing, I would appreciate it. That's a 25. Alright, let's get rid of this 25 real quick. We can do better than that. When we tame the Yi Ling, I'll probably tame a garbage level first, just to see how it goes. And then once we've mastered a garbage level, we'll try to go after a higher level. Like maybe like a 130 or something. Like what is with all these special ways of taming creatures? Like what, whatever happened to the traditional knockout tame? I'm surprised with all these trees, Thylas don't spawn on Aberration. That really shocks the hell out of me. Because you would think this would be the perfect space for Thylas. Ah, I got you. I got you before you could shoot at me. You didn't expect me coming. Hello, Gigantoraptor. That's a 50. Hey, there's a Spino right here. Beautiful Spino. Please be a 130. Get out of here, Raptor. 25. Damn. Shame, because you are a beautiful color, too. There's another one right here. What level are you? 20. Ugh. We can do so much better than that. Get out of here. That's a 60. That's the highest level we've seen. We can do way better than that, though. I think the lowest I'll go is 120. That's a 10. Certainly not going for that. 30. 40. If only there was a 1 before it. That would have been perfect. 
you were a 140, that would have been perfect. Hello, Spino, what level are you? 60. That's the second 60 we've seen. We can definitely do better than that. Alright, there's just Sarkos everywhere. Ouch. Don't want to deal with you Sarkos right now. Oh, there's a Spino right there. Please be at least a 120. 50. Damn. If only there was a zero after the five. That would have been perfect. Please be at least a 130. 55. Alright. We can do way better than that. Nine. There's another Spino. Ten. Really? There's the 125 Gigantoraptor. I'd rather leave that alone. I want to see if I can tame that one. Maybe next episode we'll go after it. I'll get some ghillie armor ready and then we'll... I'll end the episode by getting some ghillie armor ready and then we'll see what we can do about it. I haven't found a single high-level Spino at all. Like, I haven't really been lucky so far. We'll keep searching, though. Maybe we'll come across a 140 or something and then we'll tame it. I've got 39 arrows, and my crossbow should have enough durability to knock one out. Alright, there's the 125 Gigantoraptor. Oh, it's got a mutated baby. That's even better. Hello, Spino. 25, really? Can't you, like, put a 1 before the 25? And it's right by base. Nice. 90. Okay, that's the highest we've seen. But I feel like we can do way better than that. The next Spino is going to be a 130, I have a feeling. Or max level, even better. I don't think I can see anything down here. We're out of render distance. That's a rock drape. That's the first rock drape we've seen. Yeah, I'm getting out of there. I am getting out of there. All right. Yep, I see another Spino. What level are you, sir? Game? You are another 10, really. What is with all the garbage levels? I swear, there's more garbage levels than actual high levels. My raptor. I really don't care. We've killed 23 Spinos so far. Is that one right there? Another 15. Make that 24. Come on, at some point we gotta come across like a 140 or something like that. At some point. Alright, there's a green drop here. Let's see if it's worth getting. For a chest piece. Sap tap. I might grab the sap tap. I've seen worse loot. I've definitely seen worse loot from drops. 135, okay, finally. Sarko piss off. We finally found a 135 Spino. How many sales do we have? 24 sales later. 24 Spinos later, we finally find one. All right, it's a female, so that means we are gonna have to get a male next time we go out. So let's go ahead and try to tame this Spino. Mr. Spino, I would rather you not be in the water because piranhas fill the waters like it's nobody's business. Alright, that's right. Let me tank you. Tank him, Sarko. Termagator. Yeah, that's right. I don't know how much damage it's doing per slash and I really don't care. It took a while. It took 24 Spinos, but we finally managed to find one. This is our 25th Spino. 30 points into melee. The melee doesn't seem too bad. I'd rather you not be in the water when you get knocked out. Come on, stop running away from me. Don't you dare hit that Parasair. And down you go. Awesome. Alright. And we are stuck inside the Spino. Well, you know what? It's fine. Passive. Alright, Sarko, do you have any Prime on you? You do. Awesome. Alright, so we'll take the Prime off of you. And I will let you guys know when this Spino tames up. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. 
And there we have it. Spino has been tamed. 135. It took long enough. Damn. All right. Let's see. Prime. We can check the stats like right now. Let's check the stats. See what you got. 35 points into health. Okay, not bad. 23 into stamina. Oxygen food. No one cares. 35 into weight. 42 into melee. So the highest point is definitely into melee. This guy is a female, so we're going to need a male. So I'll tell you what. I'll look around a little while longer, see if I can find a high-level male. And if not, I'll see you guys back at base. There's one right here. That's a 35 female. All right. Oh, wait. A Spino saddle requires silica pearls, doesn't it? I'll worry about that later. What will you? 15. You're a 15 male. There's a blue drop. Let me go see what's in this drop real quick. All right, that crab should be distracted on the on the stego. Oh, we got a cannon. We got a cannon from that. That's awesome. We got a toilet. We got a cannon. And I'm not really sure what else we got. 130 female. If you were a male, you would be perfect. All right, what do you have? 17 into health. Only nine into melee? Dude, it's got terrible melee. It's probably gonna have like something like 20 points into melee. Yeah, I'm definitely killing you. The 135 we have is way better. Nine points into melee? Keep in mind, that's a wild one. At this point, I'm just keeping the Spino sails just to keep track of how many Spinos we've encountered. Just to keep track. Is that another Cosmo? That is another Cosmo. Level 25. I think the one we tamed was like a 35 or something. That was a 125 crab. Well, if the Rockwell boss requires Spino sails, that will not be a problem because of the amount of Spinos that we've killed in today's episode. So we should be all good to go when it comes to Spinos. And we're officially back at base. Home sweet home. Sarko, great job, buddy. You know, keep the polymer just in case we need it. Arrows, we'll take the arrows and the sails, the Spino sails. So yeah, we've got 36 Spino sails. If the Rockwell boss requires Spino sails, then that won't be a problem. All right, Mr. 75 Gigantoraptor. I'll I'll keep you alive just in case the 125 doesn't work out. All right. So what I might do is see if I can get some silica pearls because we need that for the Spino saddle. Don't really know where to get them, but not really sure. All right. Good job, Tiffany. You can go here. And Pugsley, light up the place for me, would you please? Ah. <sighs> Nice light. And here, of course, is our Spino. Look at this. She's a beautiful specimen. We're gonna need name suggestions for her at some point. But yeah, let me go make the saddle real quick. And uh, I'll see you guys when we test her out. Alright, and the saddle has been crafted up. I'm gonna have to put you away so we can test you out. Go outside and test you out. Oh, we got the crab just standing there, making sure nothing goes wrong. Alright. Spino, let's go. We got the saddle ready to go. Alright, let's ride our Spino. Let's see. We do 395 damage with the bite. That's good. With the slash, we do 593. And this is without the water buff, mind you. There we go. Alright, so let's see what we do with the water buff. So with the bite we do 454 and the slash does 682. That's really good actually. Really good. So obviously for this guy we're going to need to level you up. 
or not level you up because of breeding. I mean, it doesn't really matter. You can see its stats anyway as long as we have the Dino Ball mod. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Otter. Are you really attacking me right now? Now we do 3,000 damage even. That's without the water buff. With the water buff, the bike does 3,400. The slash does 5,100. Yep, that's, that's way better. All right, we got a very powerful Spino now. All right, so we got ourselves a Spino in today's episode. I think we'll leave you just outside the pen because you're relatively big. Okay, what's in the way? The dead Sarko. Right, let me see if I can find a way up here. And then maybe next episode I'll get some ghillie armor and see if we can try to tame ourselves a Gigantoraptor. So all we need to do is distract the parent and then we can, you know, interact with the baby and whatever. All right, Mr. Spino, I will park you just over here, and then we'll head back to base, and then we'll wrap the episode up and call it a day. We we did pretty well. We tamed up a 135 Spino. Yeah, I think it was a pretty good day. But yeah, and with that... Oh, no, no, I did not mean to do that. But yeah, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.